Yeah? Good afternoon, sir. My name is Felice Almen, and I represent the Santo Group. We're looking for able-bodied augmented persons like you to help us create the future. Don't take this the wrong way, but this might be the wrong town to hawk a dream of the future in. Don't you think it's exactly the right one? Prague, a city with no respect for the choices its citizens made to become augmented. The choice you made. And you're going to tell me Santos found a city that does respect us? We're making it. You can't deny the world has to change. For the better this time. Augmentations helped us take great steps before. And we can do it again. In Rabia. A concept city. 3D printed. Beyond state of the art. A symbol of evolution. In the deserts of Oman. I've seen the new stories. But Santo's not a charity, and I don't think your stakeholders are philanthropists. That's why they've asked people like me to spread the word. To make an offer. Incentive-driven employment for any augmented person. You'll get a sponsored work permit for the duration of the city's construction. And after that? A guaranteed place in the residency lottery. I appreciate that you believe in what you're selling, this new future. But the future the Augmented want is the same as anyone else. And the world won't allow it! I'm sorry. I, I'm not supposed to. Santo is the only corporation in the world to increase its Augmented workforce in the past two years. Did you know that? That must be convenient for a construction business. It's the opposite. Our CEO's life has been threatened for supporting the legitimacy of augmented people. But he, Mr. Brown, understands that the augmented saw the future early and rushed to meet it. I thought the Udalek complex was Santo's future for the augmented. From what I've heard, it didn't go to plan. Not to our plan. Utelec was supposed to be a low-cost, high-volume housing solution for transient workers. It was never meant to become what it has. And why didn't Brown step in? Doesn't look good to have your name associated with an odd ghetto. It's out of our hands. Since the incident, it's been run by the Czech state and their police. That will never happen with Rabia. So this incentive program, positioning Rabia for the Augs, it's all on Nathaniel Brown? Everything. The industrial printing of the city, the archaeological design, the recruiting drive, even the street teams. Mr. Brown met us personally to sign off on us. Would you believe it? Yeah, I think I would. Archaeological? Architectural ecology. Rabia is zero footprint, fully self-sufficient. It is not just his solution for the augmented. It is his solution for cities. It is visionary. There is no other word for it. Right. Unfortunately, most of the visionaries I've met were so busy chasing their grand plan, they lost sight of the little people. What guarantee do I have that life in Rabia is different than the segregation here? Or is that a lottery too? Santo is the guarantee. We keep the rights to the city in perpetuity, never handing it off to people who want the augmented out of sight and out of mind. But that's still exactly what you're doing. A city in a bubble, born from fear between augmented and non-augmented. There have always been divisions in society. There always will be. That's why there are walls. Someone has to build the walls, and that's Santo. You've given me a lot to chew on. I can't sign up with you on the spot. 
Just consider it. What I've told you. I'm not trying to sell you the e brochure of Rabia. You've seen it all anyway. They're just pictures and holograms. I want you to believe in the place. Santo says they're going to make the future a better place. Santo and augmented people just like you are the end of the The man they named this district after was something wrong. Jensen, what's wrong? What are you doing here? Miller sent me to find you. Thought you might have run into trouble. He said that? Did he use those exact words? Because it's not my fault! What happened, Smiley? One minute I'm in there running the show, and the next they accuse me of trying to tamper with evidence. Me! Can you believe that? I would never do that, Adam. Never! It's our crime scene. Exactly. But try telling them that. The minute they went for their guns, I decided it was time to shut up and get out of there. They accused me of tampering with evidence. They're probably destroying all the evidence there is right now. <laughs> you know, at first I thought this was about Sonia. Sonia? Sonia who? Oh, just some girl I've been teaching English to. Turns out her husband is a little territorial. You know the type. Smiley. Right. Back to the case. The thing is, I think I found something in there, something big, something that could just blow this case wide open. I just, I, I just need to get a look at the scan of the blast area, so... Actually, it's a good thing that you're here. I don't suppose you could... Jensen your way in there and grab it for me? So what am I looking at in there? It's a blast site. There's debris everywhere, and plenty of cops, too. Once you get past the turnstiles and security offices, you should have a clean path to the tourist office where they have the scan. They don't see you. How many cops are inside? I don't know. Several. They all had guns, so I didn't stop and count them all. There's at least one guy in an exosuit. And my guess is they'll shoot first and bury the bodies later. What do you think is on this scan? It's evidence, Jensen. A 3D mass spectrometer scan of the explosion site. And? And, if I had one more minute in there, I'd have it with me right now, and I could find out. But the fact that they don't want me to see it makes me want to see it even more. I'm sure it's important. We need that evidence. Yes, exactly. That's the spirit. We need it. But you won't be able to just walk in there and ask them for it, since you're Interpol and, you know, augmented. After yesterday's attack, they're not exactly fans of the, uh, hmm. So where do I find it? The forensic team set up camp inside the tourist agency, or what used to be the tourist agency. Get to their setup, grab the DSD with the scan on it, and get out. Easy peasy. This could take a while, Smiley. Got it. I'll get out of your way, head back to HQ. Good luck, and, uh, uh, let's not tell Miller about this one, okay? Right. We might as well head back. There's no getting through that way. This area is restricted to civilians. I'm with Task Force 29. Thought maybe I could take a look around. You thought wrong. This is a local investigation. You Task Force guys can go swing your dick someplace else. That's fine, forget it. Done. Bye. Get back. No hands are allowed. I thought he'd still be in the hospital. Anomaly detected. 
detected. Access granted. Granted. Access granted. Whoever worked on this
No, they've already done the preliminary structural analysis. We're fine here. No worries about that. Anything else? Okay, good. Back to your boat. Everyone on the arm will come and stay out of the way. I'm the merchant of others. What was that, Kopecky? Nothing, sir. Just commenting on the swaggy bastards that give me. That's what I want. Now go. Keep watch for any clanks. I'm going to come back and see your hands. This violence was devastating. Co bylo? Smiley, I've got the scan. Yeah? Fantastic! Bring it back to my office and we'll see if I'm right. Copy that.
Zasranej aug ve vagonu pro naturály. Chcete snad vyvolat paniku? Ukažte mi papíry. Dělejte nebo vás seberu. I don't have time to waste with this. Make it fast. Vemte si je a vypadněte, až příště pojedete metrem, použijte vagon pro augy. Máme svých problémů dost i bez takových potížistů jako jste vy. What the hell did you do, Jensen? State police are saying another augmented terrorist just hit them at the train station. They were interfering with evidence collection. Fucking A. Now I'm ordering you to see our psychologist. Can't defend against that kind of Ozen's in the office waiting for you. Copy that. Have to meet Smiley there anyway. We'll do it fast. Because Cheng found us a new lead in the case. In telecam footage, fingering up. It's going to put you inside Gollum City. Adam, I finally decrypted the audio off the Whisper chip tap. Fucking cold, man. You gotta hear it. I have my hands full right now. Tell me where you are and I'll come when I can. There's an old limb clinic in the Daphne district. It's closed down. Nobody goes there anymore. I'll be inside. at the train station. The police scanner said an augmented terrorist had returned and was attacking investigators. Smiley told me he asked you to get him something from the blast site. Was that you? Why did you attack the police? They threatened Smiley and were about to tamper with or destroy evidence. I tried to be careful, but things just got out of hand. Fuck, that's bad. Could have been worse. I guess. Miller didn't seem to be having a good day either. He stormed out of here after having a little chat with a new psychologist. Are they getting you to talk to her too? Yeah, that's partly why I'm here. Have you spoken to her yet? No. As if I don't have enough to worry about, now I have another person to convince that my stress level shouldn't keep me off the field. I'm ready for active duty. You'll get there, Aria. Keep at it. Always. Stress levels won't stop me forever. <laughs> good. Do you know where Miller went? He didn't say. He just ran past, didn't even look at me. State police want to talk to him? I don't know. He's under a lot of stress right now. And I don't think all of it's coming from work. He never talks about his personal life, but... He used to stop and talk to me on his way out of the office. Hasn't done that in a while. Hope he's okay. You were saying your stress levels were affecting your chances of becoming a field agent. I have a rare... Well, that comes... I know. Good. It took me months of rehabilitation. Don't give up, Adam. Hoorah. I gave you your... Yeah. You're saying I need... Yeah, who doesn't? Hey, how's it going? Do you have the scan? Yeah, it's right here. You're a lifesaver, Adam. Seriously, Miller was in a foul mood when he left here. I don't need to give him another excuse to chew me out. He left? Where'd he go? Didn't ask, didn't think he wanted me to know. Did those state police jerks give you any grief? It's like you said, they shot first, so I took care of it. Oh, uh, okay. Good. They had it coming. So what's on the scan? Oh, that. I have no idea. What? You told me you found something, something big. I didn't say I knew what it was, Adam. I said it was something that could blow this case wide open. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm not buying this whole arc did it angle. I believe what the evidence tells me. This DSD has all the answers we need, from the chemical makeup of the explosive used down to the material in the victim's clothing. I'm sure of it. Okay, so how long until we're all sure of it? Oh, it'll take hours to sift through the data, and, and I'm seeing Sonya later to apologize for any issues I may have caused with the state police. Uh, plus, I do have other cases to work on too, Adam. I'll let you know if I, when, I find something. You do that. Take it easy. 
Thanks again, Adam. I really do hope there's something useful on that DSD. Adam, I'm Delero Zen. I appreciate you coming in to speak with me, and... Well, I know you're probably getting this from everyone today, but I need to ask. Are you okay? I've seen footage from the train station, but... Being there must have... Is that what this is about? No. That was sympathy. This is a standard agent health interview to determine combat readiness. Here, I got you this from the dispensary. You got me neuropazine? Look, Doc, I was caught off guard by a terrorist attack. Might have knocked some things out of whack, but it doesn't mean my body's gonna start rejecting my augments. True. But traumatic experiences can kick a hornet's nest into the immune system. In patients with neuroprosthetics... Would you believe me if I told you my body doesn't reject mechanical implants? <laughs> no. But my policy is for straight talk only in the room, so if you want me to believe that you're some kind of medical miracle, I guess I'll have to go with it. Please, have a seat. I've been looking over your file. There's some very interesting history here. Mind if we take a trip down memory lane? Is this gonna take long? It says here that you were with Detroit SWAT, but left in 26 to head up Seraph Industries Security Division. David Seraph was at the center of America's augmentation debate. David Seraph always attracted a lot of controversy. Yes, I've seen some of his interviews. A firm believer in human enhancement technologies. I wonder if the incident changed his view? Certainly didn't seem that way on the day. You were with him then? In Panchea? When the incident happened? Not at first. I was investigating the people responsible for attacking Seraph Industries. I was this close to exposing them when... The incident hit. You weren't affected? No. So how did you end up in Panchea? I found out Saraf had left for the Arctic installation without me. I knew it was still under construction and most of its workforce was augmented. But by the time I got there, the damage had been done. Is there a reason we're dredging up the past? Because I don't see what any of this has to do with current events. Don't you? Panchera was the fulcrum, Adam. For you and for all of society, everything changed that day. They dragged you out of the ocean and into a world that hates and fears people like you. Which actually leads me to my next question. So far, no one's claimed responsibility for the attack at Rizika. But with the human restoration vote coming, well, it's no secret Prague has become the symbol of legalized augmented oppression. And the Augmented Rights Coalition is camped at its back door trying to expose and resist it. Most of the world thinks of them as terrorists. Augmented terrorists. If it turns out they are guilty, well, being augmented yourself... How am I gonna feel? This isn't about Augs versus Naturals, Zalara. This is about terrorism. And in my book, there's no excuse for the taking of innocent lives. No matter the reason. So if Talus Wrecker ordered his people to do this, then... It's my job to bring him in. Not to judge whether he's guilty or innocent. Well, look, I think it's safe to say that you have all your faculties about you. I'll let the director know that I'm officially clearing you for the field. Well, it's probably best if I get back to work, Doc. I'll see you around. Adam, I'm glad you came back. Hey. <clears throat> you didn't get held up at a checkpoint or something, did you? I'm inside the clinic, waiting for you. Sorry, Alex. I'll be there as soon as I can. Hope you're not losing sight of what's important here. Sorry, this place just brings back memories. Don't take too long. 
Glad you can make it. Any trouble getting away? Miller's been giving me some leeway, but not much. I did survive a terror attack. You and me both. God, sometimes I really hate the city. It used to welcome people like us, go out of its way to entice Oggs to live here. This clinic was built because Prague saw us as its future. Now, look at it. Times change, Alex. I know, trust me. Even got the scars to prove it. We've been working together for a few months now. I still don't know much about you. What, you trolling for my secrets now? Just the good ones. How did you join the Juggernaut Collective? Well, they got me out of a tough spot. Before the incident. I was working for Bell Tower flying VIPs around Panama and I stumbled into something big. Something very important people didn't want anyone to know about. So, they ordered Bell Tower to kill me. Janus warned you? Got you out? A friend of Janus's, someone in the Collective who used to work for Bell Tower, too. You don't mess with these people, Adam. Not by yourself. I learned that the hard way. You're a valuable asset. The Collective could have sent you anywhere. Why Prague? 
You really need to ask? Ever since the incident, paranoia and racism are eating this city alive. The whole world's watching just to see how Prague handles its Og problem. Didn't realize the entire collective was pro-Og. Not everyone is. But we all know our real enemies need chaos to operate in. Play the right chord, pull the right string, and Prague has plenty of that. You said we got something? Yeah, listen to this. A little heads up would have been nice. Sending your team to Dubai was my call, but now we need to go by the book. Focus on Ark. You want me to pin all of this on them? The bombings in Prague, the break-in at Bessel Life, and Dubai? Officially, all five attacks involved augmented terrorists. Is that clear? Yes, sir. But send me the reports if you want me to prove it. Because Ark don't operate in North America. They're setting up Ark, Adam. They sent you into that ambush in Dubai, and now they want to pin everything on the Augmented Rights Coalition. I told you Miller was dirty. I agree, it doesn't look good. He's pulled me off Dubai, put me on the train station bombing. I think he's about to send me to Gollum City. The Udalek complex? <laughs> You're not gonna like it there. It was built by the Santo Group as temporary housing for transient workers. But now... Now it's home to every unlicensed dog in the Czech Republic. And it's where Ark's made its headquarters. Shit, man. What are they planning? We need to play this smart, Alex. Think about what we heard. What was that bit about VersaLife? You mean the break-in that never happened? Yeah, I started digging into that right after I decrypted the conversation. What'd you find? Like I said, man, it's the break-in that never happened. VersaLife is one of the biggest pharma companies on the planet. The only one still manufacturing neuropazine. If it got broken into, it would have been big news. So why are they saying it did? VersaLife doesn't produce just neuropazine. They've got a huge research and development division. Yeah? So? What does that have to do with ARC? Why frame them for breaking? They want them to look like terrorists. I guess it depends on what they'll say was stolen. See what the Collective can dig up. If this really is a conspiracy, that break-in will be the threat to pull on. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna finish my investigation. Find out who really bombed the station. I'll let you know when I turn up. Same here. Good luck, Adam. Miller, we still going to Gollum City? You are. Meet me at Kopecky's puppet shop. Your pilot's en route. I'll brief you there. Copy that. Thank <laughs> you.